Marilyn Monroe is one of the most famous Hollywood divas of all time. Although her first films were not very successful, she managed to become world famous. With the publication of her pictures in Playboy and through the performance in Love Nest came fame. Her performance in Gentlemen Prefer Blondes and The Seven Year Itch then made her a superstar. But the pretty blonde who turned everyone's head and is still considered a sex symbol today had a turbulent life. In 1962, the actress died of an overdose at the age of only 36. In search of her great love, Marilyn met several men. You could say she led a fast-paced private life. The movie star married three times, and these were the men of her life. At her first wedding, the actress, whose real name was Norma Jean Mortensen, was just 16 years old. She gave her neighbor, James Doherty, her hand in marriage. But the marriage was not under a good star. The young Marilyn dropped out of school and became a housewife, a role she didn't really like. About her marriage, she once said, I almost died of boredom. When she started working as a model, a new phase began for her. Her husband was against a career in show business, but she didn't let that stop her. The couple divorced in 1946. In the early 1950s, she had an affair with talent scout Johnny Hyde, who was able to get her some minor film roles. He negotiated an important contract for her with the film production company 20th Century Fox. He died a short time later. Marilyn was upset about it, but she never stayed alone for a long time. She was involved with director Elia Kazin. And had other short love affairs with men from the film business, like Nicholas Ray, Ewell Brinner, and Peter Lawford. Then she met husband number two. In 1952, she met and fell in love with New York Yankee. Joe DiMaggio. The baseball star was one of the most famous athletes of his time. The press followed the couple everywhere. The two married on January 14, 1954, but the bond of marriage did not last long with them either. After only nine months, Marilyn filed for divorce. The actress also dated Marlon Brando for a while, but only one other man could really conquer her heart, screenwriter Arthur Miller. They met in the early 1950s, and from October 1955, their relationship became more serious. Although the film production company had advised her against a love affair with Arthur, because the FBI was investigating him, she held on to her new love. They walked down the aisle in 1956 and were married until 1961 when they divorced. Only a year and a half after the divorce, the Hollywood star died on August 4, 1962, at the age of only 36 years old.
The cause of death remains a topic of conversation to this day, as not all the facts surrounding her death are known. What we do know is that the reason for her demise was an overdose.